Hey guys, what's up? It's Nicole Chanel here and welcome back to my channel. If you guys saw my last video, then you would know that I just filmed that and now I'm filming this and then I just threw my hair up because it's really late and I talked a lot in my last video. If you guys haven't seen it, I'll go ahead and link that down below for you guys. But yes, I'm wearing the same outfit because they're my jammies and I am almost pretty much ready for bed. I'm not really a shoe and clothes kind of girl. I'm more of like a purse person. So when I invest my money into like wardrobe type of things, I invest my money in purses. I really wanted a summer purse and since it was getting into spring and summer, I feel like why not have a summer purse? I'm more of a Louis Vuitton person, so all of my purses are made by Louis Vuitton, except for this one that I'm about to show you. So this is actually the first time that I'm seeing it in person, so I'm excited to see what it looks like too. So I was on Pinterest, of course, and I somehow stumbled across a Michael Kors purse in the vanilla print, and I was like, oh my gosh. I did some research and I was just, you know, trying to find the perfect purse that would be for summer. So I was like, okay, well, if I can find one, then I'm gonna get it. And I did, and so let's go ahead and unbox this baby. So this is what it looks like. And it literally came in the mail about like two days ago or something like that. But I've already started to open it a little bit right there. I'm so excited because this is the first time that I'm even seeing this purse in person. So I got it open. So this is what I pulled out. The side right here, I don't know if you guys can see this, but I'll read it to you. It reads a number and then, oh, I think this might be like a model. So I'm just gonna read it to you in case you guys are interested. 32S5GCPC7B, and this is in the shade vanilla, or I guess like the color vanilla. And then it says the size NS. Oh, no size. I think that's what that stands for. And then um, the name of it is the Cindy. The Cindy Dome Satchel, I believe. Let's unbox the rest. I should say unbag since it didn't even come in a box or anything. Does Michael Kors come in a box? Let me know down below. Okay. So we'll work. So as it's kind of like wrapping around it, so I wonder if this came from the outlet or if this came from the Michael Kors stores. I forget that the, actually, we'll just see on the inside. Ooh, so this was like freshly packaged. This wasn't even out on display or anything. So it does make me wonder if this was from the store or if this was from like an outlet. There's the adjustable strap there. I don't know if you guys can see that. So this is it. It's very, very simple, but I like that. So this is the back. It has a leather strap here that's adjustable. And then it has gold detail chains right there on the side. And then it has a gold D ring right here on the sides as well. And then so it has the gold zipper here and then it has a gold zipper pull there as well. And then also it has gold detail and that says Michael Kors right there. And then as we open this up, there is tissue paper inside, which is always fascinating to look at. They really stuff this sucker, don't they? Whoa. It's pretty spacious for a small bag. So it has a side pocket here without a zipper. And then on the other side, there is a zipper. I definitely would consider Michael Kors a designer. I know that some people don't. Um, but I definitely do. This is a great option. A lot of his stuff resembles Louis Vuitton, Givenchy, Prada, Chanel, and that sort of thing. Um, and so I definitely think that this is a great option for those who don't want to spend a boatload of money on Louis Vuitton, Givenchy, Prada, things like that. Um, and you could also find a, you can get a great quality purse for you know, something significantly cheaper than any of those other big luxury brands. Um, although I definitely invest on Louis Vuitton, that sort of thing, but I like this. I thought it was really great for summer. So the tag here shows its authenticity, you know, that I really did buy it um, from Michael Kors and that it's not a um, replica or anything like that. But here's the tag here and I'm gonna go ahead and read that to you. So this specific bag here that I have is the Michael by Michael Kors Cindy Large Dome Crossbody in Vanilla. 
and like I said there is no size although it says large so that's a little weird and then um, it says MSRP I'm not too sure what that stands for sorry the tag here shows that it was 168 um, I think with tax I paid how much did I pay honey mm -hmm. okay you're a great help this actually reminds me a lot of the Louis Vuitton Alma bag and um, you know, of course mine doesn't have the straps, but the Alma definitely does and you could actually get it in this size. Also give this video a thumbs up if you guys want to see a review on this bag or if you like these kind of videos. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know down below what you guys would like to see next and I love you so much. Thank you so much and I'll see you next time. I hope you have a beautiful day because you are beautiful. See you guys. <laughs>